have been spending a lot of time becoming experts. And everybody, what are we experts about? Everybody. Bats. 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 We have become experts on bats. We have read lots and lots of bat books. We have watched bat videos. We've done lots with bats. So today, we're going to use that expertise that we have gained to do something creative. Well, today what I did is I gave the students a beginning, middle, and end to a story that I wanted them to write. And we have an essential question that you are going to answer, which is, how would a bat help a bird survive in a bat's environment? Okay, so that's what you're really thinking about. Creativity means that you have to think differently and uh, use your imagination. We like to use our imagination and we did kind of like a fiction story. Oh, it was really fun. That looks good. Remember, just do the best you can. Yeah, that's true. Using creativity makes a deeper understanding of the content because they have to use that convergent thinking where they're taking all aspects of something and then weigh it and then bring it back together and say, okay, what can I do with what I know? Now, is your story going to be fiction or nonfiction? It's going to be a fiction story because we learned in science that bats really only live with bats. Species stay with their own species. But it's kind of fun to play with and just pretend. So of course it's going to be fiction. But we also want you to use some of the things that you've learned about bats. The bat took the baby egg to its cave. Soon the baby egg hatched from its egg. Then the bat thought what to name her. After the students completed their stories, then they picked what they thought were important events from their stories and they made illustrations. The spiky stuff, it's cracks that the bat hangs from with his claws. Then they took pictures and we uploaded them into the computer. On Photo Story, they were able to record their own voice reading the story and it made like a mini movie. They do not know what to do with the egg. They look for the mama bird. They can't find her. Creativity is important in the classroom because it boosts interest, it boosts enthusiasm, it makes the kids wonder about what's out there in the world and want them to learn more. It's the impetus that's going to make them go out and read and, and research. And it makes school a place where they want to be. Creative is very cool and people like it because they get to do lots of fun stuff. 